Hello everyone, welcome to the Mad Life Fever Legend of Fake Grand Order of Camera Arc Movie! Yeah! So, ladies and gentlemen, PV4 just came out, I think it was this morning or last night. I don't know because it wasn't being announced it, like until this morning. So, well, how can I say? I've been told by my subscriber that the P new PV just came out today. And it's apparently gonna be like the main PV, if the title is correct. Yeah, it's called main PV. So, well, how can I say? PV3 reaction was kind of fun though. We get to see more of what to expect from the movie. So, hope you guys have a chance to check out my PV reaction. So, yeah, PV3 was like two months ago and now we have a new PV. And the movie is coming out like in two months' time too. So, yeah, really looking forward to see whether or not I'll be able to watch it in December because I'm not sure whether I'll be in Taiwan because I know the movie will be coming to Taiwan, but I'm not sure whether I'll be able to watch it in Taiwan by then. So, we shall see, of course. So, you guys pretty much see from my previous PV reaction to the Kamala arc. Yeah, you can say I was very excited for it, yet I'm not sure uh, what to expect from it. People told me that this arc is a lot more, how to say, deep and more troublesome to pass during in the game and most importantly one of the hardest singularity to, to like win in so that's what I've been told from you guys so well let's just see how this goes man because I'm really looking forward to see my girl Saber become uh, a villain or a cast I heard that she's now like a Lancer type because and she has bigger breasts too and she's like one of those more stricter king this time rather than be a very wholesome Saber that we've been seeing so well without further ado let's check out the PV shall we so, okay, this uploaded like literally today actually. So, yeah, you can say it's been uploaded and then now to just see what's it all about. And I'm pretty sure I need to say that I'm looking forward to see, well, my girl Mash again. And of course, Ben, uh, I think we're gonna see other like characters such as, you know, Saber. And I think like, Mordred will be back too. So, well, and of course, I'm not too happy to the fact that Shang Zhang is now being waifu'd, but well, it's for the fan base I, I, after all. I mean, hopefully I like her in the end too. So without further ado, here we go in 3, 2, 1, BAM! Yep, I think his name is Ben Diver, if I pronounce his name correctly. I think, I remember seeing her like back in like two, the 2006 Fate series one. She like saw Saber die right in front of her eyes. The last part of the episode. So this is, yeah, redemption I guess. Oh ho 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 ho. Yep, there we go. My boy and my girl and of course, La La Da Vinci is tagging along this time. Ah uh, yeah, Autoria. Oh my god, there'll be a lot of death. There'll be a lot of death in this. And Mash being beaten down. Oh ho ho! Yep, thank you for. Oh ho ho, let's go, baby! Oh, this is. I think I'm gonna, I'm gonna like this arc a lot too, because I can tell there's a lot of good, good deep drama and good fights. Is that the Holy Grail? Oh, Shang Zhang, there she is. Oh ho ho, I can tell, I have a feeling this is gonna be a very good arc. It's, it's by, by the way, there's two parts to this movie. Part 1, which will be coming out two months later, and part 2 sometime in the future. Oh ho, wow! Yo, Mordred! Yes! Oh man, I can tell, this is gonna be a very good arc. Holy god, Mordred! Oh my god! Can't wait to see Mordred in action again. Yep, December the 5th. Ah, and this will be the merch uh, for us to buy when we go to Japanese cinemas. Or Taiwan cinemas sometimes too. So, well, how can I say? I can tell from just this PV that it's gonna be very deep. And very, how to say, action packed. And lots of death happening. Well, Babylon also has the same thing too. But I've been told by game players that this is like one of the hardest singularity to pass. And yeah, that's what I've been told. And of course, can't wait to see my girl Saber being a badass in in a different well class, I guess. But I'm more looking forward to see Mordred again because you know the way she died in how to say the way she died. In, oh, he or she she died in Fate Apocrypha. It's just I was like really. That's how you died in Fate Apocrypha, or just it vanished away. I wasn't too happy with that part, to be honest. But oh well, guess they did her dirty. Um, but well, how can I say, man? Can't wait to see her in action versus Ben Diver, if I pronounce his name correctly. 
I can pretty much guess that this is gonna be all about Bendover and of course uh, Ritsu, uh, uh, what's his name again? Uh, Ritska, Ritska and well Mash will be helping out um, him to like um, maybe redeem, redeem himself or maybe get back to Autoria uh, side or something like that or trying to help him accomplish a mission but then I'm more looking forward to see how Shang Zhang gonna uh, come out, uh, you know, impress me with this because dude, she's he, he, oh, she now is being white food. Look at that gigantic lump of breast in, oh my god. Woo! Man, she's stacked. Holy cow. Shang Zhang, man. She, being white food, and he's like one of the most iconic Journey to the West character in my time watching Journey to the West back when I was a kid. Uh, I'm not sure how I feel about it though, but yeah, it seems, uh, it seems like they want to like increase the fan base for Journey to the West for why not, I guess. But it seems like Assassin will be back. Yeah, I think it seems like King Hassan will be. I think it's King Hassan. Oh no, I think just a uh, uh, just you know the Assassin will be back. Um, yay, I guess. I guess like you know after watching Heaven Fuse, I'm not sure how I feel about him. Um, well. Okay, and yeah, it seems like there'll be like, a side to it, like the Egyptian side to it, and there'll be like the assassin side to it, and then there'll be like the Camelot side to it. So it seems like they'll be jumping between areas, and there'll be some sort of like, battle between different divisions too. And it seems like Ritska to come here. To, oh, yes, we they come here to fix the singularity and find the, the Grail too, but also helping Bendever overcome his, well, some uh, problems, I guess. Uh, but yeah, it seems like there'll, there'll be some interesting. Um, development from this um, well, arc indeed and I'm hoping that this arc can be something that I would say oh my god it's like a masterpiece well obviously I said that um, Babylon is like one of my favorite arc or, um, or show for, for you know last year and this year but I would say that maybe camera can like be take one step further in terms of like you know, the popularity of Faker and Order like I said guys I don't play the game I do, to be honest I don't have much time now even I having I even I don't play much day or life Spirit pleasure anymore, and that's like the only game I'm playing. I'm like play it like once every day, like for one hour only. Yeah, I'm not much of a gamer to be honest, guys. So don't don't tell force me to play the game. Just help me out in the conversation below, because I want to play Fake Grounder, but I spend too much money. When I play Gacha games, you know, when I play like Gacha game, I spend money. Okay, I if I dude, come on, if I see a waifu, I would spend my ass out on it and my mom is not too happy about it when I play their, their, their life spirit pledge where I spend like over two thousand dollars on Kurumi, okay, on leveling up Kurumi so yeah, fake grand order is just like, yeah, I wish I can play it but, but the fear is I, I would spend too much money on it because I'm when I play gacha games, I spend, okay so, well, yeah, from what I can see, the movie is going to be action-packed and I can't wait for it. And to, before I end the video, yeah, just check out the voice actors. Yeah, Mamoru, I can re I recognize that Ben DeVille being voiced Mamoru because he has this unique Mamoru tone to it, I guess. Uh, to wonder who voices Shang Zhang, though. Hmm. Uh, Shang Zhang with voice by Mikato, Mika, uh, Mikako. Oh, she's the Sugumi voice actor. Okay, and Tristan with voice by Koki. Okay, interesting. Um, but I'm more I'm more excited to check out um Koyasu because he's the Dio voice actor. He'll be voicing Ozima Diaz if I pronounce his name correctly. Yeah, it seems like we're gonna see some interesting Dio voice in it. Hopefully he sounds like Dio. And Gawain be voiced by Takahiro and well uh, Maya has been voicing Leonardo da Vinci. Good I guess. Um yeah, seem, seems like we're gonna see some recognizable voice actor from this, so well I just say, I'm really much looking forward to Fake Grand Order, a uh, Camelot movie coming out on December the 5th. Hopefully, hopefully I get to, a chance to watch it in the cinemas if I'm still in Taiwan, by the way, because like this next two months, I'm, I'm uncertain where I'll be. I'll be back in Vietnam, I'll be back in Taiwan, but who knows, man. It, it depends on uh, the sort of like the board, opening up the border thing, because I, I, my, my, my real home is back in Vietnam. So, well, how can I say? I'm really much looking forward to check out this movie. If it's available online, I'll react to it, of course. But if, it, if, it, if I'm able to watch it in the cinema, I'll go into the cinema and watch it and give a movie review to it. So, with that said, hope you guys enjoy my PV reaction and analysis to this PV. Give a like, enjoy this uh, reaction to so, some of See you next time.